So you bring up in that that we want to own our money, and like there's something about the nature. Like that's kind of the fascinating thing about Bitcoin is that it's an independent system of ownership. Like there is no there's no authority telling you that you own this thing. Bitcoin is the authority, and essentially everywhere else in the world, we don't have that. Like that's that's completely everything that we own. We own because some authority higher up the ladder says that this is ours. And if they stop saying this is ours, it's basically not anymore. That independence is completely missing until Bitcoin. What is it about ownership that is connected to morality? About property rights? Why is that so integral? Well, property rights are are essentially like the most basic human right, if you think about it.、Uh, there is no other right without property rights.、Uh, you know, you think about something like freedom of speech. It doesn't make sense unless there's property that you're talking about.、Uh, it's because we have public land that we have to even discuss things like freedom of speech. You do not have the right to come into my home and yell at me, right? Because it's my home. It, it, it's my property.、Um, The thing about property rights is that、uh, there, there are two sort of like legal ways in which you recognize property rights. There's there's、uh, positivism, which says that the government gives you the right to do X, Y, or Z, or have what X, Y, or Z, or whatever.、Um, and there's the natural law philosophy, which says that you know we we have these rights already, and that the government can't take them away. That is indeed what this country was founded on. Right? We hold these truths to be self-evident that all men are created equal, and you know we are endowed with the right to liberty, you know,、uh, property, and all, you know all these other rights. But property rights are at the core of what it means to own something. And if you don't own something, then you get into positivism, and every evil authoritarian regime has、uh, that that we think of as evil. Has been positivist. You think about Nazi Germany or Soviet Union or any of these places where they, they commit these atrocities. You know,、uh, the the moral sort of case for positivism comes comes from the government decides what is moral. It is a might makes right philosophy. A natural law philosophy means that you actually. Have rights already, and that the government is there to protect them and not take them away, or give them, or do whatever. Bitcoin is a natural law money. The dollar is a positivist money, and that's the big difference. It's one is used to control, one is there to give you freedom. That's it.